Hello everyone and welcome to this Minecraft education support video. My name is Danny and today we'll be diving into how to connect players to a multiplayer world using join codes and other methods such as connection ID. Whether you're a teacher, setting up a class, or a student eager to join, we'll walk you through the process step by step. Let's begin with the basics. In Minecraft Education, connecting to a multiplayer world is straightforward. There are three primary methods, using a join code, joining directly via connection ID, or share link. First, let's explore using a join code. Join codes are a convenient way to connect players without needing to share connection ID. Go to the main screen and then click play and then join world. Here is where you can enter the code for the world. It will be four, maybe five pictures that your host gives you. Please make sure you are joining someone from the same domain as you. This will only work if you are all from the same Microsoft 365 organizational account. For many of you, this will be people from your same school. If you want to join via connection ID, go back to play and then join world. Now click the three dots on the bottom right of this page. Here, you can enter the connection ID your host gives you. Now for the host's perspective. For them to see a join code, connection ID, and a share link, they need to host the world they wish, then click escape to pause, click the second tab to the right, and here you will see a join code followed by a connection ID as well as an option to generate a share link. These are the three main ways to join a Minecraft education world to play multiplayer. And there you have it. Connecting to a multiplayer world in Minecraft education is as easy as generating a join code or using a connection ID. Whether you're hosting a classroom session or joining a friend's world, these methods ensure fun multiplayer experiences. If you have any further questions, feel free to reach out to our support team. Happy crafting!